Isolated gastrocnemius tightness, or the stiffening of calf muscles, is associated with several painful foot conditions. While leg and foot pain are a common occurrence in children, the prevalence of gastrocnemius tightness during their growth and development is not known. Researchers from Norway thus sought to assess gastrocnemius tightness in 204 healthy Norwegian children between the ages of 5 and 15 years. The researchers also performed footprint analysis to assess any potential correlations of foot morphology with joint function. Gastrocnemius tightness was assessed using the Silverskjold test by measuring passive ankle dorsiflexion or the upward bending and flexing of the foot while the knee is bent and extended. The test was considered as positive when the ankle dorsiflexion decreased by greater than or equal to 10 degrees from a flexed to an extended knee position. Thresholds for equinus contracture or impaired ankle movement were set at either less than or equal to 5 degrees or less than or equal to 0 degrees of ankle dorsiflexion when the knee was extended. Correspondingly, footprints were assessed for each foot. The researchers noted a decrease in ankle dorsiflexion as the age increased, suggesting an age-dependent decrease in ankle flexibility. Interestingly, 54.9% of children's feet exhibited calf tightness when the threshold was set at less than or equal to 5 degrees, compared to merely 3.7% of the feet when the threshold was set at less than or equal to 0 degrees. There was, however, no association between foot morphology and dorsiflexion measurements. These findings indicate that gastrocnemius tightness is a common finding in children but does not necessarily warrant a pathological diagnosis unless applicable at a stricter threshold.